What is this? Remember when you bitched at me for getting cherry ice cream? It's disgusting! Why didn't you pick that one? Look at Jack. No! Get away from the chicken! <laughs> Here, last week. Check. Okay, let's go. On the road again. How do you plan on drinking this? What's your tactic? A straw from Starbucks. Let's go, little pal. It is October 28th, it is Friday, I am one day out from Provincials and we are currently driving to Ottawa. I am currently drinking this massive thing and what I didn't think about is how much I'm going to have to pee. So instead of stopping and wasting time because it's already about a five hour drive, we just drive, pull over to the side of the road where there's lots of bushes and you just go. It takes like two minutes, not even, and then you just keep going. Um, it's a little bit chilly, but you gotta do what you gotta do, right, Levin? Yeah, it's, even, it's better than a bathroom. Like, when you think about it... Public gotta... bathrooms are disgusting. Exactly, so... Yeah. Eddie's on Ontario 401. Does it suck? Continue. No, it's great fun. 401 to 310 kilometers. Uh, I'm having fun with my 4 liter. Oh god, I have barely even dented it. I have five hours to drink like seven liters of water. And we're gonna be in the car for the next four hours. I didn't really think this part through. <laughs> Get back in the car and go! There's literally so much. Ew! <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Look how much we had. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> that was a fucking water fountain. I told you I had to go. I know this isn't good for performance, but I need fats and low sodium and lowish carbs. So, gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> No, you're not supposed to have your hand. Best girlfriend ever. Wi-Fi? I'll trade you. Mm -hmm. So who's powerlifting here? Me. <laughs> You'd think, right? That it would be him? I don't know. He's pretty buff. <laughs> More of a bodybuilder. Yes. Okay. No, you do that. Yeah, what's the difference? Powerlifting is just... Exactly. Powerlifting is like a sport. No, 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 no. It's like an actual sport. Yeah. Bodybuilding is like you stand there and you pose right. and you're really jacked okay, and, and really you're lean. Actually you're actually being strong and... Doing stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who got you into powerlifting? He did. Oh, okay. He was a bodybuilder oh, fan. Who coaches you? You do. And oh. Jesse does too. Oh. Oh. Him and you're on second floor, so the bridge over to the conference center is on the second floor as well. That's cool. All right. Thank well, you. Good luck. Thank you. Okay, have fun. Let's go. The conference room is literally down here. Is that where it's happening and stuff? I think so. I think it's Let's see. Big bathroom. Oh, this is locked here. Oh, this is fucking bomb. This is... That was a little kitchen. 
Where's the opening? Oh, it's not dramatic. Let's see. Oh, yes. Look at that bricks. Look at those bricks. What is that over there? I don't know. This is sick. This is nice. Ready? <laughs> the warm up area for tomorrow. This is the warm up area. Yeah. Here's the warm up rack. There's the bars. Some colors, some bars. Here's, here's a rack. Hello YouTube! So we got to the hotel about an hour ago and we just did a pit stop to Walmart so I'll show you what I got. First, for tonight I have to drink, not all of it, but probably two more liters at least. For meat day I got this mango chicken because we do have a microwave in our hotel room. It's got tons of sodium and tons of potassium, low fat and high carbs. I got some cinnamon rolls. This is what I'm going to eat first. Just the regular oats. Obviously a monster for caffeine. This was high in potassium. I'm gonna drink probably at least one of these. And this, beef jerky, more sodium, and same with this. These are just low fat, high carb. Yeah, and that's everything. Oh, and I also got this like cheap meal thing. It doesn't have any sodium in it, so hopefully it will help me drink the rest. And I'm about to eat my last meal, which is just chicken and broccoli. It's about 6.15. Oh, 6.07, about to eat my last meal, and then I'll be in a fasted state. My weigh-in is in 12 hours. Oh, whoops. It is now 7.45 and we are planning my attempts. So last meet, there's me, I weighed 59.1, so hopefully I'll weigh less. I'm not 21 by the way, that's a lie, I'm 22. So for squat, I did 67.5, 72.5, and 80, got all of those. This meet, I'm going to do 65, 72.5, and 82.5, so that's a 2.5 jump. Oh, the bench makes me sad. So I only got my first attempt, 42.5, and then I missed 47.5, so my only goal is to fucking hit that. So I'm gonna do the same thing, 42.5. Hopefully I'll get the 40, not 47, yeah, 47.5, and then go for the 50, but obviously if I don't get it, I'm gonna try that one again. Last time for the deadlift, I did, I opened with where is it here? That's not me. Where is me? I opened with 105 because that was what I needed to qualify. So I was just like, fuck it, let's go with it. So I got 105, 110, 117. So for my total, where is me over here? I had a 240 total and a 270.74 Wilkes, which put me at fourth for that meet, so not bad. So yeah, it's best to plan out your attempts before so you know what the game plan is. I'm probably gonna go to bed within the next hour. Even if I don't sleep, just lay here. Weigh-in is in 10 hours. Hopefully we're less than 59.1 and this water cut was not for naught. All for naught? All for nothing. All for nothing! Okay, that's probably it. I will see you tomorrow in my meet day video. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.